and welcome back to another daily grind video today we have two challenges that are 500 so i'm gonna wait until tomorrow to force myself to do challenges since we have an open slot um i can play red spells and that means i can play lelia <laughs> it's been <clears throat> a deck that i've been enjoying playing because it's so easy to hop into a match win or lose and go to the next one um i i like that because it you know i'm not sitting here uh if i'm aiming for the four wins this is the perfect deck to do it with because it's you're not really wasting your time um trying to get a win you know uh it's either you win or you lose <laughs> and you move on to the next one um, like this, it's, it's, it's a, it's a keep, because I have a card that actually, you know, I can play, so that's just what we're aiming for, we'll keep, see what our opponent does, we're keeping, when swept Heath, into a tap land, or, yeah, okay, land pass, <clears throat> I'm sure they know what this deck is. Uh, they're running. They're running uh, the colors like uh, to mess with my combo. So interesting. Okay, swinging for two. Got it. Um, I can pass. I don't need to play Lelia this turn. I can play it next turn. Do what they got. Do what they got. Swing for two. Okay. All right. Well, kind of forced to do it now. Probably have a counter spell. No. Mm. Okay. Yeah, figured. Well, I can play it next turn. <clears throat> we'll see how that goes. So we'll do this. We'll do this. Uh, swing. Oh, death touch, is it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's fine by me. As long as I don't have another kill soul, we're fine they do or a counter spell or something Oosh. Oof. <clears throat> okay all right um cool we win i think I don't know how many triggers that is. Oh, it's not a lot. Oh, no. Yeah, now we win. Done. Triggers on the stack. I'm just wondering. Yeah, got it. So there you go. <laughs> so even if you they kill your, uh, your Lelio, on one turn, it's it's fine. You can always get it the next turn, and there's a win. You know, um, took less than five minutes. That's what makes this deck so much fun to play when it comes to, um, how do you say? And trying to get your four wins, it's consistent in the sense of uh, it's short matches. Um, Basically, once I have no way to, uh, how do you say, no way to continue my aggression with, with Lelia is just kind of, you just move on, just accept your fate and like, well, that sucks for me, you know, and you move on, but yeah, no, this is a, 
fun deck. I like it. It's it's been it's been nice having a deck like this uh, <clears throat> to go to uh, when I'm just trying to get quick wins. All right, cool. Like obviously we we have rats and and uh, Adeline, which they're very good uh, when it comes to quick wins. Uh, but this is uh, top notch. <laughs> uh, of course, there is a huge downside of like like this, right? Because uh, there is 94 lands. Um, <laughs> you you, you kind of go with whatever you can. Um, uh, last night I was trying to get a, a couple wins, and yeah, it was uh, it was pretty devastating uh, to see me mulligan down to one. Um, but that's just how the cookie crumbles. Let's play this, play this, boom. This will swing. This one. All right, cool. <clears throat> now, unfortunate for me that, I mean, I would prefer them to, whenever an opponent casts a spell, ooh, nice. Uh, swing. That. Play lamp return and turn. Okay, gain a life. That's, that's not cool, man. How dare you gain life like that? Let's fight against a target creature. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Take action. So then this turn, I play this, I play this. Now I go ahead, draw your card. Swing. Alright, cool. Already got him down to 16. What's up? What they got five, six mana. That'd be cool if they just tap out for something big that I don't care about. would make my life easier. Morari's Wake. Nice. Yeah, oh, fantastic. Uh, I win? Uh, nope. I want to <laughs> not discard it, but play it. Yeah, no. Try your card, dude. Yep. Yep. Draw, draw your card. <laughs> I do apologize, but... Yep. Yep. No. Draw your cards. Uh, they probably have not seen this deck before and are like, wait, what's happening? <laughs> and three triggers. Cheese it. The game. Yeah, they're like, what? Yeah, this deck is uh, it's really nice uh, like that. Again, two wins. I got less than 10 minutes in. So, and even if I lost, I just concede and move on to the next one where there are matches that i play where it's like 20 plus minutes and then i lose in the end <laughs> so it's just one of those where it's like this is nice because it's they're really quick matches i i know if i'm gonna win or lose pretty quickly all right cool one goes first we are gonna mulligan this unfortunately mm-hmm Three Morgan. Pony goes first. Mulligan again. Mulligan again. Mulligan again. Mulligan again. Mulligan again. Mulligan again. We'll keep. <laughs> it is okay. Yep, that's fine. Is it high toughness? Total toughness. Okay. Well, that's fine. Am 
land. No? Wait, do they not have a land drop? Ooh. Unfortunate. <clears throat> oh, they don't have a land drop. They kept a two-lane hand. Ooh. They have to have something else to play. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Um. Yeah, let's fucking go. Block? You want block? I don't think so. <coughs> Digging through my deck more, you know? That's what that does. So they're gonna play their commander? No. Okay, take action, sure. Um, yeah, no block. It's fine. Yeah, I mean... I'm gonna swing anyways. Meh. What are you gonna do about it? Damn, yeah, that sucks. It's nice that they're <laughs> mana screwed for a bit, but... It's, uh... Kind of uh, annoying. Really? Green, blue. Play the battlefield, draw a card. Okay. Um, I guess I'll. Uh, so I don't turn target creature card from them. Okay. Uh, no attacks, I guess. I don't know if I would play this as a commander, but I don't know. I would have had it in the uh, Arcanus uh, deck, the Defender deck. No blocks. Yeah. No, that's a control for each one. Oh, well, look at that. All right. Uh, well, well, no attacks. I think I lost. I just couldn't find into the right spell. It's fine. No worries. <clears throat> Didn't spend too much time. Less than five minutes. And we just go to the next one. You know, yeah, if it's unfortunately again, like this is the downside to this deck. It's it's a glass cannon. Um, there's many things that can go wrong. But when it goes right, you know, it it's perfect. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful everything about it is beautiful. But it doesn't mean everything's gonna go right all the time. It's an unfortunate circumstance of this deck, but if it did, uh, it would get banned pretty quickly. And that's okay. It's okay. Um, yeah, so I haven't been uploading very consistently. I usually don't, let's be honest. You know, I have, I have life stuff happening all the time. And, uh, but I've been playing, really? Is this the same person? Coach Wes? Am I playing you again? I want to know. Can you show me? <laughs> um, I'll see it. Uh, oof. Okay. I mean, I'll keep it. Whoa, they're mulligan mulliganing aggressively. All right. All right. Okay, all right. I mean, yeah. Dig to get what you need. Mm -hmm. Let's see what they got. Triple Island. All right, well. Uh, it would be cool if I drew into 
the enchantment or Two more turns, my friend. Get. Mm, again, this creature can't be blocked. Okay. Yeah, it's not like it's gonna do anything about it. Okay. Go to my turn. This. play it right now um yeah okay do I play it now or do I wait for this sure in hand yeah done still a lot of triggers there you go so either they have an answer or yeah amazing <clears throat> That was good. Yeah, I was like, I could put it on there, but then I could just put it in my hand. Yeah, so we got three wins already. What, uh, 17 minutes in? I'm telling you, this deck, if I'm going to link it in the description below, um, it's, you know, it's really good. Uh, I got it from Saffron Olive. Uh, they got it from someone else. I don't know. Uh, there's a video of it somewhere. Um, yeah, speaking of which, like video subscribe just in, just in case you want to you know i usually do it at the end but you know just thought i should promote now right it's just that's what normal people i feel like more normal youtubers do it towards the beginning of the video you know like and subscribe and all that um uh, the whole bell icon thing I, honestly i'm not i'm not ever going to tell people to put the bell icon thing because i never use it i I really, um, there's only specific YouTubers that I, uh, do the whole bell thing, you know, it's just, I don't know, it's just, it has to be specific YouTubers that, um, what's the word, they upload like maybe once a month or something, or once every few months, um, like, uh, uh, Magic Content Creator, uh, Ristic Studies, um, I, love his stuff I, I love video essays uh so he's one that i had the bell icon on because whenever he uploads a, vi a video i'm like oh hell yeah i want to watch because again it's a it's a it's a you know product that he's invested a long time or a lot of time into and it's a really good product usually and and you know i want to uh, want to see it as soon as possible or you know be informed that Hey, guess what? Uh, this is out. Uh, the other one is another video essayist. Video essayist? I don't know. Um, uh, Jacob Geller. Uh, he does like video games and movies and other stuff like that. I really enjoy his content. So another person I uh, put the uh, bell icon on because uh, I want to know uh, when a video is up by them. All right, so my opponent has answers. All the answers. Every single one. Uh, does Battlefield me sacrifice on life? Yeah, probably. probably. Forest. Put up to two basic line cards, put them in Battlefield Tower. Okay. So just ramping up. That's cool. So it has a polluted delta up. So. Let's see what they do. Um, I'm definitely going to oh Well, I'll say, do they have an answer? They could. They could definitely, um... Crack. Delta. Fatal push. There we 
Did I already play a land? Yeah, I did. Okay. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't crack Polluted Delta. Huh. One, two, three, four, five. They could have played Mudratha this turn. Yeah, I mean, kind of have to. Take action. Yeah, very unfortunate, but it's what I have to do. Um, I got to hope that I get a, uh, what do we call it? Really an island. Oh. Mail two cards and draw two cards. Okay. Spell bomb. Oh. Well, that's a good game. I'm not going to be able to, uh, with Aether spell bomb on the field, I'm, I'm never going to be able to, to do what I need to do. Yeah, just finding a, um like any deck you play, knowing when you lose, basically like that. Them having Aether Spell Bomb on the field was because they could just bounce the creature back to my hand, and I only have one creature, right? Um, it's just really devastating for this deck because. This deck uh, revolves around, um, uh, what do we call it? It revolves around playing my commander and pumping up the commander. So just one of those where, you, you know, you know when you've lost. Uh, your opponent got the best of you. Nothing you can do. There's nothing wrong with that. You just can see to move on. This is going to be interesting. This is a double strike deck. I go first, okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Sucks, sucks, sucks. That sucks. Very much sucks. Uh, that sucks. And we'll keep. <laughs> yeah, so that's, again, glass cannon. It sucks when this happens, but it happens. Yeah, it's for Sentinel. It's fine. We're not really doing anything first strike yeah that's fine we're gonna do this we're gonna do this turn this to a 3-3 three, three. see what they got Four. Yep. No, I'm not gonna fall for it. They have something with flash or or what's the the land that um deals damage to attacking or blocking creatures. Mm, yeah, no, no attacks. I'm Yeah, that's fine. Feel the energy of battle. Any guided light. Keep watch for intruders. Mm-hmm. We've got the edge in this fight. Yeah, no blocks. Um, uh, no attacks. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm, yeah, good game. Very unfortunate, but it is what it is. 
Yeah, I mean, again, glass cannon with ninety four lands in your deck, uh, and the chances of you getting what you need when you need it are pretty slim. Woha, Jaws of Conclave. Okay, free Morgan. Here we go. It's nice when you go first and you have what you need, but it doesn't happen very often. Mm, we'll go with that. Yeah, this is good. This is good. This is good. Land pass. As long well, they're running red and white, so that is downsides. If they get double white, I'm probably not going to be playing or attacking with Lelia. Okay, red, white, a red, green. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, there's a white source. Never one on one counter would put in a creature you control twice. Okay. All right. So. There are no attacks for now. The reason being is because they could play another white source and then there goes Lelia. Uh, okay, perfect. I win. Oh. Cast. Da -da 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 -da. Cast this on this. Triggers. 46 triggers. Okay. All right. Done. Done. Yep. Swing that. Another one. You block. They're probably just gonna sit there and be like, "Ugh, I'm gonna time out." It happens. Whatever. I, while I'm here, this will be our fourth win. I want to thank you for watching. Um, if you enjoy the video, please leave a like. Uh, if you want to know a more detailed description of how I grind and what what I look at when it comes to grinding, I'll have a um, video linked in the description below. Um, just, you know, again, just showing how I grind and everything. Um, if you enjoy my content overall, please subscribe. Uh, leave me a comment if you've been playing this deck or not, uh, how it's been working for you. If there's another glass cannon deck out there that I don't know about. Uh, let me know and yeah um, oh they conceded we got our victory there is win at number four and that's it for today i'll see everyone next time bye bye